Hi guys, hope you're all okay. Today I'm going to be showing you what's in my fridge. Um, I've done one of these before but it was back in 2013 um, and as some of you may be aware I've had a bit of a lifestyle change since then. If I remember I will link the, la the old one in the description box below but yes I thought it might be fun. I've been watching a lot of these videos lately so I thought it might be fun to show you what's in my fridge. Um, on the outside of the fridge, you've probably seen this in vlogs, we've got lots of um, photos off of Instagram that we've printed. We should probably get some new ones done, because some of these are a bit old. So, we open it up. Where to start? This is quite a normal level of fullness, I think, for our fridge. Um, let's start in the door. So, we've got some... Orange Lucasade, that's John's. Um, we've got some red milk or skimmed milk. Uh, we've got some J2O Spritz in apple and watermelon flavour. This to me is a heavenly combination. Anything that's apple or watermelon flavour, scented, I'm in. Um, then I've got some green Frugo juice. It's called Ultra Green, it's really nice. Then we've got lots of stir fry sauces. Um, so there's a satay one, a hoisin, sweet and sour, um, sweet and sour, and what are you, what are you, sweet chilli and garlic, pop you back in. On the next shelf it's all condiments, um, it's John's, it's squeezy cheese, this one's mine, uh, it's 50% less sugar, 60% less salt tomato ketchup um, squeezy mustard, John's then we've got some Sainsbury's, be good to yourself 80% uh, less fat mayonnaise, that's mine sweet burger sauce, that's John's oh we need some more of this um, the barbecue sauce from Sainsbury's, we both like that one and some guacamole up the top, it's a bit more hickledy pickledy. We've got some curly whirlies, a bar of dairy milk that hasn't been opened yet, some chicken stock, some dips from Domino's, and probably all, oh, yeah, garlic and herb and barbecue, because it's pretty much the only ones we order, and some really out of date chocolate. These are actually in the last What's In My Fridge tag, which was, as I said, in 2013. These are Thornton's Name Truffles. These are so out of date, they'd probably be the nastiest thing on earth if you ate them. Uh, basically, these are the truffles we had as favours at our wedding. Uh, me and John got married in 2010. <laughs> um, yeah, and I kept one, and I've kept it in the fridge, and... I'll probably try and keep it forever, I think, because it just makes me think of the happiest day of my life. Put that back up there. Right, and then into the main part of the fridge. In the veggie drawers. Oh, so we have carrots, and that's half a cucumber. Courgette, there's some mushrooms there, a butternut squash, and some radishes. In the next drawer, we have some cherry tomato. Oh, we have an accident awaiting. I think you were up there actually. Yeah, so we have some cherry tomatoes, a random lime that's falling down off there, some pink floor, there's two bags of spinach in there, and some leeks. And then on the next shelf. We've got two packs of chicken legs, a whole cucumber that's too long to fit in the veggie drawer. There is some unsmoked bat bacon. We've got some squirty cream in the light, so it's like 45% less fat. Some turkey mints, there you go. Um, some sandwich ham, and then there's pierogies, which is Polish dumplings. All around that. These are probably all in the wrong shelves, but you know. And as I say, there's two random limes rolling around in the fridge. On the next shelf, we've got some watermelon, which I'm going to eat as soon as I finish recording this video. 
Um, there is some reduced fat Brussels pate, some chorizo, some almond milk. I believe it's the unsweetened. Yeah, it's the unsweetened version. Oh no, I can't get it back in. Um, some leftover salad. I had some family over for lunch yesterday, so there's leftovers. So got some leftover salad. We've got some olives. Um, we've got some cocktail sausages, the puppies have these. We've got some Chinese um, mini vegetable spring rolls. And then we've got some more ham, but this is like nicer ham. Let's try and put this all back in neatly as it came out. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, on this shelf there is considerably less cheese than there was in the 2013 video. Um, however, that's mostly because I've given up cheese for Lent rather than I don't eat cheese anymore. Um, but yeah, so we've got some dairy-free pure sunflower butter, some green grapes, some, oh, some free-range West Country eggs. I only bought these recently, but I've not tried them yet. Some dairy-free um, banana pudding stroke yogurt type thing. Um, the reason I bought this is because I really quite love the taste of artificial banana. And uh, yeah, that's why I've got those. Uh, then we've got some grated mature cheddar. Um, these are the leftovers from yesterday. I made heart-shaped toad in the holes, or mini toad in the holes. There were two left. And then in here there is homemade potato salad. It's like garlic heaven. Um, got some Philadelphia whipped with garlic and herb. And then this, if you see that, is a Slimming World crustless quiche, but there's no cheese in it, so I could eat it. Um, a big chunk of cheddar. And we've got some grated mozzarella. Actually, there is still quite a lot of cheese in here, seeing I'm not eating it at the moment. And up here, we've got halloumi. And then there is laughing cow. And then there's plastic burger cheese. And then up on here, we've got some more of these frugo juices. So there's a green one and a black one. Um, some tomato puree. Chopped tomatoes. I think they're all, they all chopped tomatoes. Passata, what are you? Oh, your silken tofu. Bought this to make a dessert and I've not been brave enough to try it yet. Um, we've got two cans of the no added sugar ginger beer that John likes. Can of Foster's, some very lazy chopped garlic, some reduced sugar raspberry jam, sun dried tomatoes, taste the different sticky fig chutney. This stuff is amazing. Um, some roasted peppers, some sweet sliced beetroot, and some, um, it says sweet cucumber sandwich slices, but they're pickles. And that is everything in the fridge. I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, please give it a thumbs up, comment, subscribe, share, and I'll talk to you in the next one. Bye guys.